Oh boy. Hello. Your destination is on the left. I think it took me to uh another uh child. Um God I can't say it. <laughs> Although the big dog back here. Oh, I forgot about that dog. Well, those are interesting. Maybe they didn't uncover all the bones or skeleton. To try to do more tomorrow too. <clears throat> it doesn't want to, it doesn't want me to do Christmas. <laughs> Which I don't blame it. This here doesn't even seem like Christmas anymore. After the virus shows up and yeah. It killed it killed people spirits. So what I'm going to talk about is about the hidden grave, okay? <clears throat> I noticed um, the schoolhouse is like a block away. Now, in the 1800s, around there, there was a cemetery where the school was. And remember, it took me to, a couple of months ago, it took me to a cemetery by the school, but there's nothing there. Of course not. The, <clears throat> I mean, there was a cemetery, where was the school, but they moved the cemetery. But the question is, all right, I think about this every day. The question is, how many bodies did they unburied uh, there? I mean, how many people um, they uh, they dig up the grave and moved them? That's what I'm saying. <clears throat> is there? Any impossible still coffins under some of the ground? I mean, think of it. You got the cemetery was there first, and then all of a sudden you got these houses and school. So the question is, did they dig up their bodies and move them, or did they leave them under there? 
I don't know. I'd love you guys to see ya. Peace.